next tier I have is ANF Abercrombie & Fitch. I'm uh, just looking at some of the longer term charts over here. This is the weekly chart. Very wide range bar over here to keep in mind on any kind of a move. Uh, it looks like this $11 area should be held as support. This stock does pay a dividend, so it may not dip. Or excuse me, may not dip much more than that. As you can see, there's a longer term bottom right around the same region. A little bit below that now, so we'll see if it gets a, a technical dip or if there's you know, some dividend bargain hunters out there. Let's see what happens here on the daily chart. It did turn into a dragonfly doji type candle right at the 50-day uh, simple moving average. So any move over that 1171 area will probably be bought. And this is what I'm going to be looking at. And again, this is another one that's not too fast of a mover. So uh, it's going to be some nice laid back trade. Just, you know, I'll put in my order, sit back, wait and watch, see what happens. And I will look for a target up here around 12 and a half. say 12 and a half because if this sell-off right here was weak then price action should be able to at least take out this high we'll see, we'll see you know, how far up there it goes there's quite a bit of volume here so uh, could possibly roll over and not even give me a trigger in here and based on this setup though even if it does come back down here I will also be watching this level here which is uh, where the 8 period is moving up through the 21 and see if the buyers can help support it up there a little bit more